Hi everyone, today I'm going to be talking to you about United Bank and four ways that you can close your United Bank account. So first, what might be some reasons that you'd want to close your United Bank account? Well, there could be many reasons. Some of these could include fees that the bank is charging are too high, they require a certain minimum balance, or you've moved to a new part of the country where this bank is simply no longer available. Whatever your reason is for wanting to close your United Bank account, I'll walk you through the different ways that you can do that. Now before you close your account, you'll want to make sure that all of the funds are taken out of the account and that no automatic payments are scheduled to come out. Also, if you have any direct deposits, make sure that they're no longer set to be deposited into this account. Once all of these are taken care of, you'll be ready to close your account. And for a couple of the options, you will need to access the United Bank website. As you can see, I'm already on this website and the URL is located at the top of the screen, bankwithunited.com. So the first way to close your account is going to be by calling the bank and closing your account over the phone. The easiest phone number to find is going to be the customer service phone number that's located on the back of your debit card. You can call this number, and if the first person that you reach is not actually someone who can close an account, they should be able to transfer you to the correct department from there. When you call, they may require verification in writing before they'll close your account, but closing it over the phone is usually an option. The second way to close your account is going to be by mailing United Bank a letter. This option is the least recommended one though because when you mail the letter, you won't know if the correct department received the cancel letter. This is also the slowest and most inefficient option. However, it is still an option if you prefer it, so if you choose to do it this way, you can usually find the mailing address on the United Bank website, but that can sometimes be a little bit difficult to find. So you can also try doing a Google search to find the mailing address. And if you happen to know of another way to find this address, please don't hesitate to leave a comment and let me know. The third way to close your account is by stopping by a physical United Bank branch and closing it in person. Now some banks only have a few branches, but you can utilize the website to find a branch in your area. So to do this, you're going to go to the very top of the screen, and on the right hand you'll, corner, you'll see three icons. I'm going to make this just a little bigger because it's pretty small. Of those three icons, the middle one says location. So you're going to click on that icon, and then that'll bring you to this page here where you can enter your zip code or your city. And then on this map, it'll show you all of the locations within your area. Also, this page actually took you to where you can see a couple of phone numbers that you can try calling. When you go to the branch, make sure to take some kind of identification with you, such as a driver's license or another form of government ID. The fourth way that you can close your account is by logging into your United Bank account online and making an electronic request. So for this, we're going to go back up to those three icons at the top right corner and you're going to click on the very first one which is says sign in. That brings then over this little window where you will select personal and then actually sorry you're going to go down to where it says online banking sign up but instead of clicking on that link you'll click on the one right below it that says secure sign in. Select personal and then that'll bring you to this page here where you should be able to enter in your credentials. Once you're logged in, you're going to look for the option to close your account. Sometimes this means just sending an email to United Bank, or it could be filling out an online form. So those are the four ways that you can close your account. If you happen to know of a different way to close a bank account with United Bank, be sure to leave a comment and let us know. And if you're looking for a new bank, check out the video description for more information on banking.